This is smoked wild caught sockeye salmon grilled 150 degrees for the first hour, 175 for the rest of the time. Simple, easy, tasty. The brine, one third cup kosher salt, coarse, one cup brown sugar, one quart of water. I brined it for uh, about six hours and uh, then put it in the refrigerator with a fan that I just accidentally had parts for. This is a, a drive cage with a three-speed fan. And I happen to have a little power supply, I don't even know what I use that thing for, that fit perfectly and I didn't have to wire anything. That worked out really well. And I just laid the um, uh, salmon on a half sheet in front of the fan, and left it overnight, and it made a, just a beautiful pellicle. The pellicle is very important, I'm told, on because um, that's what allows the salmon to hold the smoky flavor. Use a little bit of grapeseed oil on the skin just to keep it from sticking, and that really worked amazingly well. A little bit of a challenge to keep the green egg at 150 degrees, so, uh, you know. Also, I tried to keep the thin edges in the cooler area. I think that's the coolest area around the edges, except in the back. I know it's hot in the back of a, a uh, green egg. I didn't have, I didn't end up having any trouble keeping the temperature at 150. This is, <laughs> this was a lot of fun. I uh, uh, bought uh, a number of switching regulators. You can see um, here that I crammed one of them inside of here you see the little blue thing and the coil then that was probably two or three dollars and then uh, seventeen dollars i think for that 3d printed adapter for this dewalt battery dewalt batteries i figure that's free because i use that on all of my tools uh, which i have i don't know six batteries something like that that three amp hour is way overkill. I'm not sure exactly what the load is. I actually looked it up. I haven't measured it, but uh, I'd like to measure it with the fan at 100%. But uh, it's probably a tenth of an amp, which means what is that? Uh, 0.1 into three amp hours, you know, 30 hours. <laughs> Ridiculous. Uh, but I have uh, done. Uh, pork roast on it, and uh, it doesn't even doesn't even hardly drain the battery. Do them for eight to ten hours, something like that, maybe longer. Oh, these were an improvement on the older. Just throw it in a box. Uh, thermal cup of wires. It does help a little bit, I think. Oh, it'd be nice if they could figure that out. How to? They've been that way for. God, ever since I was a kid, uh, just terrible. Uh, they love to tangle. That's what they do. You know, <laughs> they tangle. It'd be nice to, if someone figures out a better uh, way to make a high temperature probe that is not a tangle nightmare. Yeah, I'm trying to do this with mostly with a cell phone. A couple of the pictures are, or videos are, with my Canon 6D, or with my Canon 6D, sorry. Set her up for 150 here to begin with. I'll have to damp it down a little bit because it's already at 155. And, uh, yeah, enough that it requires that the fan comes on to push air through it to get the heat up but not so much that it can't blow but it sure doesn't take much air um i didn't really use that great uh, maple syrup and i i can tell you the truth i could tell the difference because so i have used really good maple syrup in the past and it did taste a little bit better it's beautiful fish it's not really pink it's more a red Time to raise her up to 175 for the last hour. 
I basted this twice. I think it was a little over two hours cook time. You don't really need this uh, temperature controller, but it's it was fun. Yeah, it's not uh, 175 degree uh, <laughs> grill. Uh, I wouldn't normally uh, pull those uh, that temperature gauge out of there without a pair of gloves, but I wasn't too worried about it here. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? Nice and shiny. I guess it mainly from the um, syrup. That's about it. It was very tasty. I'll use better syrup next time. Try it. A little uh, extra here. Uh, basting brush. I put the basting brush in the floor. In that drawer. Gotta be here somewhere. Okay, time to get Mary Beth, she can find anything. Okay, this just sucks. I looked there. They weren't there. Thank you. Thank you.